I'm Robert Estrin. You're watching livingpianos.com. Did you know that over 100 years ago, there were hundreds of piano companies in America? As a matter of fact, over a thousand companies of all time. You might not have heard of Hazelton, but what a piano. I'm going to tell you about this piano and the restoration work that was done and explain how Hazelton fits into the history of American piano building in a minute. But first, let's have some music with some Mozart. This is just the second movement of his 330, K330 C major sonata. You may have noticed that I took extreme diminuendos in this piece. The control on this piano is amazing. As are these ivory keys, you know. If you look at them, they look so perfect, you think they're plastic. These are ivories, real ivories, the original ivories. Can you believe it? Well, the piano, here's the good news. Even though this piano was built in 1920, it was rebuilt fairly recently. New strings, tuning pins, damper felt, the works. The case was refinished. It's got new hammers. You know, my piano technician fell in love with this piano. Of course, 
he preps all, you know, so many of our pianos here. We have several piano technicians, but he works on our Steinways, Mason Hamlins, Becksteins, and yet I, every time I came down, he was playing this piano. He said he just fell in love with this piano because of its warm, beautiful sound. What is Hazelton? I'm gonna tell you about this company in just a minute, but first, a little bit of Chopin, just an excerpt from his G minor ballade, so you can hear how it opens up in something on the other side of the spectrum. And that's where it goes back to the original theme, the opening theme. So Hazelton, believe it or not, made over half a million pianos from 1850 to 1950. This five foot nine inch grand was built in 1920, as I mentioned, restored. And you know what you can't do? You can't make a piano uh, have a life like this has had if it hasn't had that kind of life. You'd have to replace not just the key tops, keys get worn out, soundboards become destroyed. This is such a well-preserved piano and has had the loving restoration before we got it because the work that went into this piano, just the refinishing, would cost close to what the, we're, we're asking for the piano. So we were fortunate to get this piano and if any of you appreciates the sound and the performance of a great American piano, Hazelton will not disappoint you, like my piano technician loves it. I hope you like it. You know, you can leave the comments here at livingpianos.com. If you haven't subscribed, go for it. You'll really appreciate it. We'll see you next time. Thanks for joining me, Robert Estrin, here at livingpianos.com, your online piano store.